Hello, what's up guys? Before we proceed to our main video, let's make an intro first, okay? Hello guys, this is Sir Luigi again and welcome to another vlog. This is all about Chinese Mid-Autumn Festival 2020. I hope you will like this video, so just sit and relax, keep and enjoy watching. Hey there, subscribe to my channel and also press this bell icon. The Mid-Autumn Festival, also known as Moon Festival or Mooncake Festival. It is a traditional festival celebrated by many different East and Southeast Asian people. It is the second most important holiday after the Lunar New Year with a history dating back 3,000 years when China's emperors worshipped the moon for bountiful harvest. The festival is held on the 15th day of the 8th month of Chinese lunisolar calendar with a full moon at night, corresponding to mid-September to early October of the Gregorian calendar. On this day, the Chinese believe that the moon is at the brightest and fullest size, coinciding with harvest time in the middle of autumn. The celebration is called Chuseok, Autumn Eve in Korea, and Chukimi Moon Viewing in Japan. The festival celebrates three fundamental concepts that are closely connected. One, it's gathering, such as family and friends coming together or harvesting crops for a festival. It is said the moon is the brightest and roundest on this day, which means family reunion. Consequently, this is the main reason why the festival is thought to be important. Two, Thanksgiving. To give thanks for the harvest or for harmonious unions. 3. Praying. Asking for conceptual or material satisfaction, such as for babies, a spouse, beauty, longevity, or for a good future. Traditions and myths surrounding the festival are formed around these concepts. Although traditions have changed over time due to changes in technology, science, economy, culture, and religion, it's about well-being together. Some of the people are asking why the Moon Festival is being celebrated. In ancient Chinese emperors worship the moon in autumn to thank it for the harvest. The ordinary people took the Mid-Autumn Festival to be a celebration of their hard work and harvest. Nowadays, people mainly celebrate the Moon Festival as a time for family reunions. And they are asking also why is the Mid-Autumn Festival so important? The day of the Mid-Autumn Festival is traditionally thought to be auspicious for weddings as the moon goddess is believed to extend conjugal bliss to couples. The festival started more than 2,000 years ago as a post-autumn harvest celebration which was devoted to thanking the gods. As the Chinese traditional, these are some gifts that I received for this Chinese Mid-Autumn Festival. So I'm very thankful for the people who acknowledge and appreciate my hard work.
here at the park see uh, today is October 1st and Chinese people are celebrating Chinese uh, national holiday and the mid-autumn festival see even if it is afternoon already though it's not yet many people later this place have many people gathering together especially in the evening if they turn the lights on this place will have many people even if it is cold already that's how the people here celebrate the mooncake festival See, they started to gather people to make this day a very happy holiday for everyone. As you can see, the plants from the improvised small lake started to change the color from green turning into yellow and brown. It means this is the sign that the weather here is now changing from summer weather and now it's autumn weather. In this view, you can see the clean surroundings, though you didn't feel the freshness of the air, but the air really clean. That's why many people want to stay outside their houses to go to their favorite places and roaming around with their family and friends. As you can see, the people here are doing their normal things. They forget the epidemic that's still ongoing in other parts of the world. Yanji is a good place to stay and safe to visit. And like what I told you in my previous blog, that Yanji is safe to visit. Now, this is the newly renovated KFC. It's famous here in Yanji City. Most of the people here, whether you are Chinese or Koreans, they really like to go and visit KFC so that they can eat other foods aside from Korean and Chinese foods. This is Gomang, one of the shopping malls here. They have been closed for about, I think, four to five years already. One of the reasons why they close is because of Taobao, because they feel Taobao is more convenient to buy many things. No need for you to go out and go to the shopping mall. Instead, they will deliver it to you at your house. After a long walk and roaming around, we decided to eat our dinner. Now, we just finished eating dinner together. As you can see, this is outside by Li Chang. You can see the beauty of this place at nighttime. Come on, 
Let's take a look and see. Narito kami sa likod ng Bailey Chang. Daming tao. Daming bisita. Mura. Mura yung bilihin dito. Okay. O, magkano yan dyan? O, patingin nga. O. Sale. Kaya mura sila ngayon. Dami pa rin na nila. So now, we are just walking many cheap products that you can buy here actually but also have an expensive one and right now you can see my companions already looking for a taxi and we decided to go home because the weather is getting cold now but still see you can see many people staying outside and having fun with their family, relatives, maybe classmates and friends. And look, still many people. So I will continue this vlog later. Okay, see you later. So this is how many people here in Yanji City celebrate their Chinese Mid-Autumn Festival See Some parts of the city they are very colorful and beautiful So there you have it guys I hope you like and enjoy watching my video Thank you very much for watching So if you are new to my channel Please subscribe down below like this video share and give your comments of course don't forget to click the notification bell so you don't get miss any future videos like this okay always remember do good make your life fruitful and meaningful keep safe and if ever you will go out don't forget to put your face mask for your own safety god loves you see you in my next video God bless everyone. Thank you guys. Sai Jen.